In part one, we evaluated the top row of functions. We will now evaluate the second row of functions. The function r of x equals 1 over x is the uh, equation of uh, a hyperbola. And the graph is such. A couple of points on that graph. One is 1, 1. Another point, negative 1, negative 1. And as to the domain, well, we do have the possibility of division by 0. If x, if we let x be 0, then then uh, we would have division by zero. So the domain equals the set x such that x is not equal to zero. Notice x can be any other value other than zero and we'll get a real number back. As to the range, r equals the set y such that um, the only way a uh, r of x could ever be zero is if the numerator could be zero. And the numerator is always one. It can never be zero. So y cannot equal zero. Uh, the intercepts. Well, clearly, by inspection, there are no intercepts. Uh, the next issue, is it odd, even, or neither? Well, this function is odd because it is symmetric about the origin. It's also uh, decreasing. So it's decreasing on the interval negative infinity to zero and in union with zero to infinity. Now, <clears throat> keep in mind, decreasing pertains to moving from left to right. And as we move from left to right, from negative to positive, this uh, function is always going downhill. As we move left to right, this function is always going downhill. So it's decreasing on the open interval, negative to infinity to zero, in union with the open interval, zero to infinity. As to absolute max or min, there is not an absolute maximum, nor is there an absolute minimum. This thing is going forever down and, and forever up. So, there are none. For the function v of x equals the absolute value of x, we can graph it by drawing several rays emanating from the origin. Uh, a couple of points on this graph. One of them, one, one. Another, let's see, negative two, two, and so on. <clears throat> As to the domain, uh, D equals the set X and clearly there's no possibility of division by zero. There is no possibility of taking an even uh, radical of a negative number. So the domain is all reals or X element of the reals. 
as for the range, that equals the set y such that, well, by inspection, the minimum y value is 0. All positive y values will be on this graph, so y is greater than or equal to 0. As to the intercepts, there's one intercept. The x-coordinate of that intercept is 0. The y-coordinate of that intercept is 0. Is this function odd, even, or neither? Well, it is symmetric about the y-axis, so it is even. Uh, this function is decreasing on an interval and increasing on an interval. So, it's decreasing on the open interval, negative infinity to zero, and it's increasing on the open interval, zero to infinity. As to absolute max or min, there is an absolute min at 0, 0.